gentlemen. It gives me very great pleasure on behalf of the Robert Stephenson Trust to welcome you to the Common Room of the Lord. The creation of Robert Stephenson and Co and the opening of the locomotive factory in 1923 was a milestone in the development of railways worldwide. We're here today for the launch of our bicentenary exhibition for the Robert Stevenson Trust, marking 200 years of Robert Stevenson and Company, 1823 to 2023. Historically, it was the birthplace of some of the most famous locomotives we've heard of, uh, Locomotion Number 1, the Stockton Darlington Railway, Rocket, and then Planet on the Liverpool and Manchester Railway, and then other famous engines that have worked literally all over the world uh, were built here in Newcastle. And it's not just the famous engines, it's the, the development by Robert Stevenson Co. in a very short space of time to transform the steam locomotive from its primitive origins into what we'd recognise today as a steam locomotive. Instead of just sort of typical colliery blacksmiths with a few engineers sort of designing these relatively rudimentary engines, this is doing the whole thing. It's a, a designated factory for building steam locomotives, um, steam engines, not just railway engines but also stationary engines for pulling wagons uphill on steep inclined plane railways, in factories, steam ships. It's starting to get more and more interested in other railways as well, so the Liverpool and Manchester soon comes along and in coming years is what you get railways all over Britain and all over the world who are going to want these steam locomotives.